I just wanted to make a quick video talking about uh, CA glue. CA glue is a two-part glue that we use on a lot of our outside corners and anytime we have like a seam or anything like that. There's actually a lot of uses for it and what it is is it's a liquid glue and then it's an activator and I've been getting a lot of questions about this so I just wanted to kind of go over it with you real quick. But I have a little piece up here that I need to glue on this curved wall so I'll just show you how I do it and um, it's really simple. You put the glue on the piece and then you activate the glue by spraying the other piece. So if you've seen any of my other videos, you've seen me use this quite a bit. We'll use this, like I said, anytime we have an outside corner or a seam, really anywhere where you need two pieces of wood to stick together and you need it done fast. So this is instant glue. You've got about eight seconds to work with it. So even though it's fast, one thing you wanna watch out for is when you connect your pieces, they need to be how you want them to stay because that glue is going to activate in seconds. So we'll go up here and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So we're getting this wainscoting done on these stairs and I've been using this glue on all these outside corners. This is a piece of flex panel molding and it's going to fit in just like this. But I want to glue all the corners so there's no splitting over time and since this is flex it's really easy to move, so I really like to glue it so it doesn't move. So the way I'm gonna do that is I'm gonna put the glue on one side, keeping it level. This stuff is actually pretty runny. And I think I have, this is medium. If you want, and if you, and I prefer if you get thick, thick is always better, because it's not gonna run around on you as much for this trim carpentry stuff. So you load it up with glue like that. And then usually I'll spray the same side. I'll spray this side, but the way I'm doing it on these, since it's activating really fast with this rubber, I'm gonna spray the mating side right here. So you spray that and you glue this. And then this is where you gotta be quick. Just like that. And I'll get that squeeze out with my finger and I'll wipe it on something else because it will burn you. <laughs> it gets hot really quick. So I'll hold this on here for about eight to 10 seconds, making sure that everything is bonded and the chemical reaction is taking place where it's bonding the two materials together. So let's see. And we're probably good with that. So now without any nails, I have just glued this corner. I don't have to worry about this corner moving on me anymore. It's good. Now I can worry about getting this straight. Because anytime you're working with flexes, they need to be, you need to be worrying about how even everything is. You don't need to be worrying about your corner. So now here's the tricky part. I need to glue this, but if I glue this, it's all gonna run down on me. It'll just run and hit the carpet. So an advantage with this flex molding is this. I can just take this piece up with my corner intact, it's not moving anywhere. And I can make this surface level. So now I can glue bending the trim. Just like that. And now I'll spray my other side. And again, gotta be quick here. And then get it in place. Just like that. Same thing, I'm gonna hold it for eight to 10 seconds and it'll make the bonding that it needs to make. So that should be good. And it's kind of dripping out. I will clean that up. All right, so I have both corners glued just like that. Now I can push this down into place, get it straight. I don't have to worry about any corners coming out of place because they're glued in with that CA glue. So I'm good to go. I'm just gonna put some nails. All right, well, this glue right here is made by a company called Bob Smith Industries, BSI Incorporated. And you can get it, I got this one at Hobbytown in uh, Fort Worth. 
and then also the activator same company and you can also get different you could use different activators for different brands it doesn't matter whatever this is it activates other brands of CA glue so you don't have to get this company for this company like type bond makes a CA glue that I can activate with the spray so it's all good and also they make a this is an aerosol spray so this is just like a hairspray and then also they make a liquid spray if you're gonna get the liquid spray it's about the same price but I think it runs out a lot faster so I always get this big aerosol can well these glues run you about for this bottle 30 bucks and for this bottle 11.99 so for the whole thing you're looking at $45 with taxes so this thing is a lifesaver though I use it on all these trim I use it on everything I can because I mean it's gonna get all your corners straight so yeah, I hope you learned something from working with CA Glue. If you have any questions, just contact me and I'll see you next time.